Can a cheap RGB light be any good? Let's find out in this video. Hi, my name is Nick and on this channel I am doing tech videos and reviews. Consider subscribing if you are interested in that. And today we'll do an extensive review of Yulanzi VL49 RGB light, an universal video LED light that costs less than $20. What's in the box? All that's in the package is uh, the light and USB cable. This light has USB Type-C port, which is great to have at this price point. Charging. Battery is inbuilt and uh, it's 2000 mAh battery. Full charge takes around 3 hours. Using the included Type-C cable and 45 watt charger. There is a convenient indication of charging process. Battery life. VL49 RGB will last around 4 hours when used at 100 brightness at 4050 Kelvin at 100% brightness in RGB mode will last around 3 hours. These tests were made for a brand new light that I have received around a week ago. And uh, let's run the tests again, but this time for the light that was in constant use for over a year. When battery charge gets below a certain level, the light will start to gradually decrease brightness and then it will switch off. battery degradation is around 8%. Design and weight. Light is actually very tiny. It's squared and it's 6.5 cm long. And its height is 3 cm. Nothing fancy in design. It's all black and grey, except for the colored sticker on the back. Body is made of plastic, which is not easily scratched and is quite strong. I have unwillingly tested this parameter, dropping other light uh, from around 2 meters onto wooden floor, and it has survived that almost with no damage. On the front we have a diffuser to make light softer, which is protected by the plastic from all sides. On the bottom there is a combined 1 fourth mount and a cold shoe to put it on a camera or a stand. And uh, on all other sides we have a cold shoe mount to clip microphones and the like. These mounts can also be used to clip multiple VL49s together. Uh, VL49 has a built-in magnet that holds it very well. And it's no surprise because uh, VL49 weighs only around 100 grams. Magnet is definitely a nice feature to have because it allows to set up lights in more places without using stands or tripods. Modes. Let's start with RGB. Full RGB spectrum you can change to any color using these buttons. Color is displayed in hue angle where 0 is red, 180 is green and 270 is blue. And you can use the same buttons after pressing mode to adjust the brightness from 1% to 100%. By the way, these lights power up extremely fast, a second or two and boom, it's ready to go. To change mode to non-RGB, just hold the mode button. Now Yulanzi light is in standard mode, where you can adjust brightness and color temperature from 2500 Kelvin, which is quite warm, up to 9000 Kelvin, which is very cool. When you keep button pressed, it goes up by 100, and if you press it for multiple times, it becomes more precise, going up by 10 instead of 100. Here I have 45 watts fluorescent bulb and Yulanzi is set to maximum brightness at 5500 Kelvin. Let's compare them. <laughs> 
Both lights are set at the same level and the same camera settings are used in both cases. Now let's try to bring our lights closer to the plant to see if there will be any difference. Let's also compare Yulanzi VL49 at the same settings with the 10 watts LED ceiling light. Here I have tried to place uh, Yulanzi light as close to the ceiling light as possible, and here I'm bringing Yulanzi light closer to the subject. Oh, and uh, if you pick up a newer version of Yulanzi VL49, it will have not only uh, RGB and non RGB modes but it will also feature the scene mode uh, such as cop car, ambulance, fire engine, emergency, fireworks, TV and so on, different kind of strobes. That is quite convenient if you want to set up the atmosphere in the scene. Oh, one important note, do not buy VL49 non-RGB. This model is around 30% cheaper, but it's not worth the economy. You don't get magnet, RGB and what's most important, light temperature control. It is fixed at 5500 Kelvin and the only thing that can be adjusted is brightness. But here you don't get the precise controls as in RGB version, just 4 brightness levels to choose from. So does it make any sense to buy Yulanzi VL49 RGBs for yourself? Well, for $100 you can get 5 lights and create a lighting theme similar to this one I have here. For this video I have used 5 Yulanzi lights, 2 are on the back, set to orange and blue, to add some atmosphere. I have one more set to 5500 Kelvin to separate me a bit more from background and to light up the shadow that would otherwise be here on my face. And I have two more lights uh, set to 5500 Kelvin, the same as uh, the one here, on this side and I use them as a main key light. I know this light setup may not be ideal, but for $100 you get a lot. Thank you for watching this video up until its end. If it was useful, hit that like button. And if you have any questions left, feel free to ask them in the comment section down below. See you in the next videos.